I've been asked a couple times over the last little bit um, just to talk a bit about how I create some of these uh, screencasts that you're uh, looking at uh, through my YouTube channels. Um, one of probably the easiest ones that I've been using is this little guy right here, which is called Screencastify. Um, it's a really straightforward little tool that um, basically sits in your uh, Google Chrome browser and allows you to just push record, choose whether you want to have your uh, uh, image shown on top of it, and immediately will upload it to YouTube with no extra steps. Um, so if you're, uh, if you're new to Google Chrome or if uh, you haven't uh, used this feature yet, Google Chrome is actually a, um, a little mini operating system in itself. And so just like your tablet or phone, <coughs> Google Chrome comes with apps that you can, uh, you can install onto it. To find your apps, all you need to do is, as I've done here, create a new tab. Um, you can just push this little guy right here to create new tabs and that'll create uh, brand new spaces to work. And uh, if you click over here where it says Apps, um, it will take you to your Apps page. And you can see I've got a number of apps that I've installed on my, uh, my computer. Um, and um, I'm sure you would have some of your own. Uh, but if you look down in the bottom corner, um, it says Web Store. Uh, so if I click on Web Store, it'll take me to the store where I can download new apps for my Google. So what I'm going to do right here is just type in the app I'm looking for, which is Screencastify. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, you'll see that I already have it installed. You can see added is listed here as, as is shown by it uh, recording as I'm speaking here. Um, but uh, for you, if this is the first time you've come to it, this will actually say add or install, which you can just tap and immediately that icon will appear right here on your um, on your uh, desktop. Um, once it's there, all you have to do is, and I don't know if this is going to work while it's recording. No, you can just see the, uh, the record window uh, popping up. But when you click on it when it's not recording, um, you will have a couple of options here, including um, what would you like to uh, record? So it gives you the option of just this current tab, um, an entire desktop, or just to record your face um, without recording either of the two. All you have to do is choose that, um, and then you'll see down in here for uh, for um, free recording. If you click down here, it'll say start recording, and that's it. Immediately, it's recording everything that's going on to your desktop anything that you're doing, everything you're saying, until you push this button here that says stop recording, which I'll do in a moment here. Um, and uh, it'll immediately give you the choice of do you want to download it as a standalone video or upload it to your YouTube channel. I usually just go straight to YouTube because it's simpler. And then as soon as you do, it will give you a link um, you can share with others to, uh, to post. Um, as always, if you have any questions, uh, feel free to uh, let me know. Um, I'm on Twitter at, uh, at DSTLearn. Um, you can also um, feel free to use the comments below.